Alright, this is uh, Shoot Steel for Robin Hood's Playground.com. We're going to be flashing a 7000 series light on uh, with Jungle Flash of 1.66 beta. Uh, when you download Jungle Flash, you're going to notice that, uh, that you'll have all these files. And you'll have one that's called firmware. If you open up that folder, it'll say place firmware here. This is where you, uh, you put in all your iExtreme uh, files and your uh, original firmware for any drives that you plan on uh, flashing. Now that's a resource for uh, for Jungle Flash to use. Well, first thing we're going to do is I took the back off this drive previously. I'm going to cut my drive on, eject it fully, cut the drive off, push it in slightly more than halfway, cut the drive back on again, and then I'm going to launch Jungle Flasher. I'm going to go to DVD Key 32 and we're going to look to see our drive properties if we have uh, uh, the, proper, uh, the proper data there. And we do. We got the PLDS, uh, the DD16D2S. Uh, uh, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be pressing this DVD Key 32. But first we need to get the probe uh, set properly on the board. It's the second hole. And what you're looking for is a steady green light. Once you have the steady green light, I will press DVD key 32. And at this point, you take the, uh, the probe off, the probe is now off, and I'm going to save my key, save the inquiry, save the identity, save the dummy. Now it says light on firmware is loaded to the source buffer. Do you want to auto load, load light on extreme? I extreme, yes, I do. And you can see there's the key there, keys here, and we don't have to spoof anything. Now all we got to do, well at this point, we can save the file, the, the CFW. Uh, then we go to MTK flash and make sure that your drive is there. Light on erase. It's going to erase your drive. You got to press yes. Now it says, are you really sure that you're about to, or you want to erase your drive? Uh, this is the point of no return, guys. Uh, I'm going to press yes. I'm going to wait for a few ticks down here at the bottom. Then I'm going to cycle my drive on and off in quick succession. Okay, it found my drive. What I have left to do is press the right button, where I'll now write my drive. And then I'll hit my outro ATA reset. Now I'm going to cut my drive off. Push the, the drive back in. Disconnect it from my computer. Reassemble the drive. And you'll have a flashed uh, drive for your Xbox. Uh, thank you very much for uh, visiting RobinHoodsPlayground.com.